Welcome back, dear viewers. Before we dive in, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and share our videos with your colleagues. In our ever-evolving healthcare landscape, nursing and rehabilitation centers play a pivotal role. Their importance extends far beyond what many of us may initially think. These centers aren't just for long-term elderly care. They're also crucial in providing comprehensive, individualized care for people of all ages who are recovering from surgery, injury, or illness. Imagine you've had a hip replacement surgery or a stroke, and you've been discharged from the hospital. You're stable, but you aren't quite ready to go home and get back to your daily routine. This is where nursing and rehabilitation centers come in. They provide a bridge between the hospital and home, offering a safe and supportive environment where patients can continue their recovery journey. These centers are equipped with skilled healthcare professionals who understand the unique needs of each patient. Nurses, therapists, and other medical staff work together to deliver a holistic approach to care. They focus not only on the physical aspects of recovery, but also on the emotional and psychological well-being of the patients. Rehabilitation is not a one-size-fits-all process. It's about empowering patients, helping them regain their strength, mobility, and independence. And these centers provide the necessary resources and expertise to achieve this goal. So, let's debunk the myth that these centers are solely for the elderly. They serve a diverse population, including young adults who have experienced sports injuries, middle-aged individuals recovering from surgery, and seniors who need assistance with chronic conditions or after a hospital stay. In a nutshell, nursing and rehabilitation centers are an integral part of our healthcare system. They fill a critical gap in patient care, offering specialized, compassionate care that helps individuals get back on their feet and return to their lives as quickly and as safely as possible. Nursing and rehabilitation centers play a vital role in the healthcare sector, providing a bridge between hospital care and home for many patients. Moving on, we delve into the crucial role that nurses play within these centers. The essence of rehabilitation is to restore health and functionality, and nurses are fundamental players in this journey. At the heart of their duties, nurses manage the day-to-day -day care of patients. This includes administering medication, monitoring vital signs, and managing pain. With their in-depth knowledge of medicine and patient care, they are equipped to rapidly identify any health issues or complications, ensuring that they are addressed promptly. But their role extends far beyond clinical tasks. Rehabilitation nurses also assist with daily activities, from personal care to mobility exercises. They are the helping hand that patients often rely on, making certain that they are comfortable and well cared for. An integral part of their work revolves around educating patients and their families. They provide guidance on managing conditions and adapting to new routines, instilling confidence in patients to take charge of their health. Furthermore, they are advocates for the patients, liaising with the multidisciplinary team to ensure that individual care plans are tailored to the patient's unique needs and circumstances. They are the link between the patient and the rest of the healthcare team, facilitating communication and coordination. Nurses also play a pivotal role in emotional support. The journey to recovery can be daunting and emotionally draining, and nurses are there to provide comfort and encouragement. They foster a supportive environment, helping patients navigate through their challenges and fears. In the realm of rehabilitation, the role of nurses is multifaceted and far-reaching. They are not just caregivers, but educators, advocates, and emotional pillars. Their work is an intricate blend of science and compassion, of clinical expertise and human connection. In essence, nurses are the heart of these centers, ensuring the well-being of patients and aiding in their recovery process. Their role is indispensable, and they truly embody the spirit of care that is at the core of rehabilitation. Now let's explore what the rehabilitation process in these centers entails. Rehabilitation at its core is a journey. It's a journey of healing, of regaining strength, and most importantly, a journey back to normalcy. This journey is far from solitary. It involves a dedicated team of healthcare professionals, doctors, nurses, and therapists, all working together with one singular focus, the patient's recovery. The process begins with a comprehensive evaluation of the patient's condition. This includes understanding the patient's medical history, their physical capabilities, and their mental and emotional state. The goal here is to get a clear picture of where the patient is starting from in order to chart the best possible course forward. Next, a personalized care plan is developed. You see, no two individuals are the same, and hence, 
no two rehabilitation journeys can be identical. Each patient has unique needs, different strengths, and their own set of challenges. Therefore, the care plan is tailored to fit these unique requirements, with the aim to maximize recovery and to help the patient regain independence. Now, this personalized care plan is a collaborative effort. It involves input from the patient, their family, the doctors, nurses, and therapists. Each one brings a unique perspective and expertise to the table. Doctors provide medical guidance, therapists devise therapeutic exercises, and nurses play a pivotal role in implementing this plan, monitoring progress, and adjusting the plan as needed. But let's not forget the most important team member, the patient. Their determination, their will, and their active participation are the driving forces behind successful rehabilitation. They are at the heart of this process every step of the way. This collaborative approach ensures that the rehabilitation process is holistic and patient-centered. It allows for continuous feedback and adjustments, ensuring the best possible outcomes. And it's not just about physical recovery, emotional support, mental health assistance, and social engagement also play a vital role in the rehabilitation process. After all, healing is as much psychological as it is physical. The rehabilitation process is a team effort, with every member playing a crucial role in the patient's journey to recovery. Choosing the right rehabilitation center is crucial. Let's discuss what factors to consider. First off, it's essential to look into the qualifications of the staff at a rehabilitation center. Do they have registered nurses and licensed therapists on board? Are they experienced in handling the specific needs of your loved one or patient? These are the questions you must ask. A skilled and dedicated team can make a world of difference in the recovery process. Secondly, consider the types of therapy offered. The best rehabilitation centers offer a wide range of therapies to cater to the diverse needs of their patients. These might include physical, occupational, and speech therapy, along with specialized programs for conditions like stroke, cardiac events, or orthopedic surgeries. It's important to ensure that the center has the resources and expertise to meet the specific rehabilitation needs of the individual. Another factor to consider is the facility's cleanliness and safety measures. This has become even more critical in light of the recent global pandemic. Look for facilities that follow stringent infection control protocols, have proper patient safety measures in place, and maintain a clean and hygienic environment. In addition, it's worth investigating the center's approach to personalized care. Every patient's journey is unique, and their rehabilitation plan should reflect that. Centers that prioritize individualized care plans involving patients and their families in decision-making tend to yield better outcomes. Finally, consider the center's reputation. Check out reviews and ratings online, ask for references, and even consider visiting the center in person. This can give you a sense of the center's culture, their approach to care, and the satisfaction of their current and former patients. Choosing the right rehabilitation center is about more than just ticking boxes. It's about finding a place where your loved one or patient will feel comfortable supported and empowered on their road to recovery. Remember, the right rehabilitation center can significantly impact a patient's recovery journey. In summary, nursing and rehabilitation centers are vital in the healthcare sector. They serve as a bridge between hospital care and home, providing patients with the comprehensive, individualized care they need to regain their strength, independence, and quality of life. The beating heart of these centers are the dedicated nurses working tirelessly around the clock. They are the ones who monitor patients' progress, administer treatments, and provide the emotional support that is so crucial to recovery. Their expertise and compassion make a significant difference in the lives of patients and their families. The rehabilitation process itself is an intricate journey. It requires a multidisciplinary approach involving not just nurses, but also physical therapists, occupational therapists, speech-language pathologists, and more. Each patient's path to recovery is unique, and these professionals work collaboratively to develop and implement a customized plan of care. Choosing the right rehabilitation center is a critical decision. It's not simply about finding a place that offers the needed services. It's about finding a center that aligns with your values, that prioritizes patient-centered care, and that has a track record of positive outcomes. Remember, you have the right and the responsibility to ask questions, to do your research, and to make an informed decision. Look for centers with highly trained staff, positive patient testimonials, and a clear commitment to quality and safety. 
In the end, it's about finding a place where you or your loved one will feel comfortable, supported, and empowered on the road to recovery. Thank you for joining us today. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it, and leave any questions or comments below. And remember, don't forget to subscribe for more informative content.